my hair, guys. I know it looks absolutely dog shit right now. <laughs> Yo, what's cracking, everyone? Eric Ship Triple One here, back again with a vlog. Now, I know I have not done these in an extremely long time, and that is because I have been fairly busy. Now, before I get started with this vlog, you might be wondering what on earth is that skunk to exhaust? doing at the front of my house well there are big plans coming up in terms of modifications for my integra type r and i'm really excited for what will be happening and the first part well i actually received that part the three inch exhaust quite a while ago about christmas and i haven't done anything since because i procrastinate a lot and i'm pretty lazy when it comes to things like this but also because you know Modifying your car isn't exactly cheap, but apart from that, stay tuned because I've got some exciting things to do uh, in terms of modifying my car, and if you guys are interested, make sure to stay tuned to my channel. But what has been happening recently? Well, for those of you who do not know, I do a lot of videography work. I work for a few car companies, and I've been absolutely loving what I do. Um, unfortunately, right now, what you see <laughs> you can't really see me too well and you know it might make me sound like a clown when I say I'm a videographer only because my DSLR does not have a flip screen and I can't I can't really see myself right now so if it's too bright and if I'm out of focus I'm really sorry because the camera that I'm using is fairly old and it doesn't have all those special features but hopefully they'll change very soon but anyways I've been doing a lot of videography work, so I do some promotional work for a car company called Brilla, which is a automotive detailing company, and what they do is that they have this special coating on their car that they apply onto any, any car, and you're able to clean the car less and still keep it as, as shiny as possible. I don't exactly know how to explain it in the best way possible, but I really do like their product and I do a lot of their promotional work on Facebook and if you go check out their Facebook, I'll put the links in the description below. I do some video work for them and I've, I've been absolutely blessed by being able to stand in the presence of some of the most awesome and beautiful cars at work such as the 458 Speciale, Lamborghini Gallardo, the Porsche 356 Vintage car which I had no idea what it was before I saw one and a lot of other cars like BMW M3, Mercedes S63 AMG and the list goes on and it's really exciting to, to be able to do videos, promotional videos that showcase these cars and that's part of the reason why I haven't been active on YouTube for like the past three weeks and that is because of the amount of work that I have to do in terms of editing, videoing and to try to get this company moving and I'm not saying that I'm the catalyst of moving this company but I really do want to make the absolute best in terms of the job that I have to do. So apart from that what else has been happening? Well because I work at this car company called Brilla there is a Japanese technician which is a very good friend of mine called Tats and he nice for me and that is to help me restore my headlights. Now, my headlights when I first bought them looked like absolutely shit and there are multiple temporal ways to fix your headlights such as putting chrome polish or just buffing them out. But eventually, as time goes on, the headlights will turn back to crap again. And you know, my headlights did not look good at all. It looked like someone pissed on them, uh, someone smeared yellow crap all over it. It just looked horrific. And even though we did put chrome polish and buffed it out, there was still that yellow tinge and that's when you know that oxidization was still there. So my friend Tats, he restored my headlights and it took him a vigorous, vigorous amount of effort. It took him about three to four hours. He had to finish it in two days actually because the first day my, my headlights were so bad that he wanted to do it properly. So what he did was that he sat down with his own bare hands and he sanded my headlights for about three to four hours and to the point I kind of felt bad for him. But it turned out really, really good and I am extremely happy 
with the way my headlights turn out and they, they, they look pretty much brand new and because of that at night time when I turn the lights on the first time when I turned my headlights on at night time I thought I had my high beams on that's how much clearer they were and I didn't realize how much it affected my visibility during night time so because of that I gotta thank you and I'll show you some of these b-roll footage right now you'll see how it looks like and I'm pretty sure you'll see them a lot more throughout this channel as time goes on but as for now I'll show you guys how my headlights look like and yeah as you guys can see the headlights look almost brand new they look so good and I'm so happy with the way they turned out I can actually see the light bulb and it, it looks amazing I just can't believe what a job Tats did and it took him a long time a long time to do this I don't know if I'm repeating myself right now but I'll show you guys the left headlight as well uh, look at this bird shit over here these Australian birds let me tell you they're ferocious if you guys ever want to come to Australia better bring an umbrella because these magpies and crows they are fucking horrible they just shit anyway <laughs> but yeah this is the left headlight so it's a huge improvement on what it was before and I'm extremely extremely happy I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself but I, I just love the way it looks I was actually wanting to purchase some new headlights because they were so bad but looks like I don't have to anymore so yeah that's pretty much how it looks like and uh, very happy very happy you guys ready <coughs> you guys ready <coughs> you guys ready to hear some VTEC right here we go you guys did enjoy this vlog there will be more vlogs to come I will be taking my car to the quarter mile hopefully sometime next week and I'll definitely post up a video on that and uh, yeah if you guys enjoyed this video give this video a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe for more vlogs coming peace